Alright, so before we do anything, spoilers for I Expect You to Die 1, 2, and 3. If you haven't played those games, go play those games. They are very, very good. Alright, so to start off the theory, the name of the game is I Expect You to Die. And in the first and second game, Agent Phoenix dies in the in the death engine and in an elevator shaft. So it seems like it would be impossible to survive exploding in the middle of space or falling down an elevator shaft. But and I don't think that Agent Phoenix did survive it. I think that in I Expect You to Die 1, 2, and 3, you're playing as separate versions of Agent Phoenix. And every time Agent Phoenix dies, they she just they just get replaced by a clone. And it's your every time you're playing as a different Agent Phoenix. So this sounds like a leap in logic, but let me explain. So Agent Phoenix, it just sounds like a randomly picked name to sound cool, but I don't think it is. I think if you don't if you don't know what a phoenix is, basically it's a bird where where it's a mythical bird where whenever it dies it comes back from being dead. So basically it's an immortal bird. So I think the name Agent Phoenix is hinting that every time Agent Phoenix is killed, they just replace them with a clone. And that would also explain why the agency doesn't care about how dangerous the missions are because every if if the agent does end up dying, they can, they can just be replaced with a clone. It's so there's no risk at all. So if this theory is true, it would also explain who the Phantom at the end of I Expect You to Die 3 is. So if you want, you can pause to read this if you haven't gotten to this point yet. But basically, what it, what it, we're focusing on the one line, um, it says, it's, it seems you're as good as they say, and said, they, they used to say I was good too. I, so this implies that the Phantom used to work for the agency, just like Agent Phoenix, but I think that the Phantom is also a, f um, a clone of Phoenix. Like, maybe the Agency thought that this, this, that this version of Phoenix died, so they, got, so they got replaced with a clone. So, so like, this version of Agent Phoenix is, like, trying to get revenge or something, or, like, trying to reach out to the current clone of Agent Phoenix... So, anyway, to recap, every time Agent Phoenix dies, the, he, she or she or whoever, whoever they are gets replaced with a clone, and, and I expect you to die 1, 2, and 3, you're playing as separate versions of Agent Phoenix, and that is why the agency doesn't care about the lives of the agents, and also the Phantom might possibly be of a clone of Phoenix that was killed, but they didn't know it. So that's the theory. Please let me know if you think that this was good. So, yeah, bye.